Hello, good evening from Fort Porto. My name is Jabwell if this is your first time here. So today I'm going to be taking you guys around Fort Porto in the night. It's basically nightlife in Fort Porto. My first impression of Fort Porto is about the roads. To be sincere with you guys, the roads here are so clean. If I say clean, I mean clean. Very clean and very nice. So I'm going to be taking you guys around Fort Porto in the night. Come, let's go. And I'm also joined in here. Ivan Atwire and Sector Uganda. Yeah. Guys, so, make sure to subscribe check to Jabu's channel. Yeah, so, so guys, all these guys are also YouTuber. She has a channel by the names of Check My Love. And then Ivan Atoyre is my channel name. And Sector Uganda is my channel name. You guys subscribe to his channel, like, a comment, and share his videos. We are in Fort Porto. Do the right same. Exploring Uganda, we are in Fort Porto. Fort Porto happens to be one of the districts that are behind all that. When you're in Fort Porto, you can see the ranges of Mount Renzori and it has a cool climate. In fact, you need to check it out. Even the climate is cool. I didn't carry a sweater. <laughs> yeah, it's actually cold. Yeah. But I will stay here <laughs> like this. And then... Uh, check my love, check out my channel and subscribe to his channel too. I have good, amazing content. You have to check me out because guys, it's lit out there. But anyway, we are exploring photo and we are going to be bringing you more content about World, World Life Day tomorrow. Thank you. So, uh, so as I'm taking you around, uh, let me first give you guys this opportunity to introduce yourselves. Yeah guys, this is Jovia, so local, please subscribe to my channel, I subscribe to his channel too, we're in Fort Porto, yay, this is Naomi guys, subscribe, like, share and everything in between, bye. So let's go and explore Fort Porto. Yeah, Uganda, <laughs> and in the past, we left Fort Porto at Porto. night. <laughs> this is uh, Wana wait up at yourself. Jabba. Anti anti wanna yany nini one. Fort Mutown, one white out foot foot. Fort Potto Mutown. Eh, Fort Potto Mutown one. What about? Eh, Weber. So there is also here chicken. Mujavali. In Coco Yameka. I'm I'm So I think we have to cross the road. So this is the roundabout. The building, though the place is dark at this time, 
but this is a roundabout. So this is a place where I think they have food. There is chicken. Too much of the street food, chicken, everything is here. And then, how much is it? Six thousand. Six thousand. Hey, guys, expensive. Chicken here, yeah, a piece is six thousand. The whole chicken is twenty k. This side is dark. You may not be able to come in. Yeah, are you guys done with it? <laughs> are you guys done with the supper? <laughs> We are supporting the local people, we are not done with supper. We are supporting the local people, the local people but we are not done with supper. Wow, I can, see, I, can, I can see sheep here, out to the other side. So this is like go down of Kampala. Fort Porto at night. Fort Porto actually, I don't know whether actually it's about 12 midnight and the place looks a bit dull. The place looks a bit dull. So if you can read in this. It's written in here, I love Fort Porto. I love Fort Porto. So this is a roundabout, Fort Porto roundabout, Demo Petro Station. Somewhere around here. The street actually is dull, but uh, it's not so bad. My camera may not be all that good, but just manage. We cross the other side.
so I was told that just up there is uh, the king's palace. The king is called who? Oyo. Oyo, Oyo. Kabamba Iguru. Oyo Kabamba Iguru. Kabamba Iguru. The chief is a fourth. Oyo Kabamba Iguru. The fourth. Oh yeah, just up there is the palace. Not too far from here. There's also Centenary Bank here. place is dull during night time it's not like Kampala where uh, uh, it, there is no difference between night and day no I think uh, maybe because the town is a bit small so many people they just go inside and sleep Big numbers to be on the street, but oh, oh, is that the reason why the hotels are very expensive? Yeah, this is a twice city, it was being advanced to a twice city. Wow, yeah. so that's why you find uh, accommodation that is a uh, big mm. because most of the tourists, most of the adventurers from different regions. But uh, come to, come what? To okay, the national parks. Eh? Yes, yeah. yes, 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 yes. Now I get it. On your right, they got the sculpture. Mm. That oh. Remember the significance of the sculpture? The big wall. Those corners. Actually, this is the only city which has the English name for portrait. Oh. Yeah. So don't forget that. Only because, because and if you go and that's here, yeah. that's where the current king of Tolo kingdom called Oyo Nimba Kawan by Guru Kidi the fourth. All the, all those titles made in court while you mentioned the hill resides. The hill it's called Kalzika Palace. Mm. That's the local name of the palace, Kalzika Palace. Yeah. Uh, 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 uh,